I think we should take a vote on who we should cook. I vote Mandy. <gasps> you mind creep! I trusted you! Yeah, I mean, I think it's a bit mean to kill the only girl in the group. Thank you, Monty. At least there's someone decent in this group. Come on, who should we kill? Well, I'm gonna go get the tea ready. We'll make Mandy less hallucinogenic. Oh man! Why did I have to join the cannibal group? I should never have let my mom pressurize me. Ah, they're gonna eat me! We're the only cannibal mushrooms left in existence. We just have to keep going. Don't worry. I'm sure you'll taste nice. This should be done in about no. ten minutes. Who should we eat next? Hmm. I think Monty will be a bit tasty. Hi, I'm Hop Mushroom. Looks like there's been a bit of fighting here. I'm here to give advice on magic mushrooms. They can make you feel sick, tired, and disorientated. But fly agaric is much more potent and risky to take. Bad trips are seriously frightening and settling, and you can't tell whether you're going to have a bad trip or a good trip. Also, you can get flashbacks sometime afterwards. You may be at risk when you're not in complete control of what you're doing. Your perception of your body and the world around you can be distorted. Eating the wrong kind of mushroom can make you seriously ill and even kill you, so don't do it. There are many different ways that I can get cocaine into my body. I can smoke it, which is, you know, one of the most popular ways. I can snort it from the powder, which is also very, very, very popular. Or I can inject it with this huge syringe. Now that is the most rare way to get cocaine into your body. Although it's the most popular way with heroin. Drugs are great. Don't listen to that drugger. Drugs are not good. Not, not, not. Hello. And welcome to therapy with Hilda. Today, we are going to learn how to bake an apple pie and how to keep your slugs away from your cabbages. But first, we're going to hear from Kirk Cocaine, a drug addict and his awful addiction. <laughs> my wife left me! <laughs> well, why don't you think back to where it started? Well, you started when... <laughs> Skunk! No! A skunk! I don't want my leather jacket to smell of fart! No, not a skunk, you idiot! Skunk! Skunk? Yes, skunk. Skunk? Yes, skunk. Skunk? Yes, just shut up, you idiot! Do you want some marijuana or not? No, how dare you! I already have her! Marijuana is my wife! I love her! I wouldn't have paid to have sex with her! Don't marry one of you more in marijuana! You're the stupidest person in the world just to <laughs> my f***ing face! Do you want some drugs? What does it do? It makes you feel happy. Whoa! I am feeling a bit down. Oi! Oi! Do you want some or not? How much? 50 quid. Come on in cash. <laughs> no, go on then. Well, we found out where it all sprung up from. Up in your slow decline. Well, I smoked my first batch within a week. I felt well good, but the voices in my head kept getting louder. 
I needed another toke, so I went back to the same dinner near the fish and pizza hat. He didn't have any weed, but I was feeling down, so I wanted something to make me feel alive. He said he had some ecstasy. I was like, WTF? I told him I was planning on going to a rave that night, but he said that the ecstasy would really big it up, so I was like, alright, and it felt so good, but then I got really thirsty from all the dancing. I had to be hospitalised and I nearly died, I laughed around my brain, it had minor irreversible effects on my brain, I didn't take ecstasy after that. Crap. Oh, good. We're making some real progress here. You should never take anything that you don't know what it is. The drug dealer was telling Borky and Bice. You never know what he could have used to make those pills. They're often made with no hygienic standards. With dust on the floor. You are always at risk, even if the drug doesn't have narcotics in it. <gasps> Physical side effects that can develop include dilated pupils, a tingling feeling, tightening of the jaw muscles, raised body temperature, and the heart beats faster. Short-term effects of use can include anxiety, panic attacks, confused episodes of paranoid or psychotic states. Yeah, I know that. There's no point telling me now, you stupid b After that, I started getting into worse, more addictive drugs, like cocaine, my namesake. Ah! That is very, very bad! Cocaine is a class A drug! You could get yourself a number of years in prison for that! Oh. Yeah, well, I got close. That's why I'm here. Got caught by the police only three days after buying cocaine. What a waste of money. You should be grateful they sent you here. You could be dead by now. You can get so addicted you can die from overdoses. High doses can raise the body temperature, cause convulsions and respiratory or heart failure. Risk of overdosing increases. It crackers mixed with heroin, barbiturates, my namesake, sedatives or alcohol. Yeah, yeah, but I'm here now. You must be helping me. Hang on. I just need to attend to some urgent business. Dumb Ugh, oh, where is she? Oh my god. Oh my god. You know, my life is so great. Please, feel free to eat my hair. My life is so great. Don't you think? I love you all, people. I love you all. You smell like cotton roses. I'd like to smoke every one of you all if I could. But you know, I can't. Bye, night. Ah, <laughs> uh, that's it. Well, my therapists are always druggies. I'm gonna go smoke some weed.